let's take a look at how to install pivot points in MT4. When you receive the pivot points, it will come in as a zip file here. So you can put it on your desktop or most likely it will be in your downloads folder here. So if you just download it, it will be in your downloads folder, which is right here. And you can right click on it and copy it or you can extract the files right here. So I have already copied it onto my desktop. So if you wanted to copy it, you would just click on copy, right click copy, and then you would go to your desktop and click on paste. In this case, I already have it on my computer. So I would just say skip because it's already there. So once you have your zip folders on your desktop or wherever you want to place it, just click on right click and click on extract files because it is a zipped folder. So we do need to make sure first we extract it. So right here, because I'm working with my desktop, it's a little bit easier here. So I'll just put it in the pivots folder. So make sure you have it on your folder, not, um, not just on your desktop because otherwise the files will get spread out here. You want it to be on in a folder called pivots. So we'll click on that and um, soon here we should have a new folder. Oh, here it is. Here's a new folder called pivots. If you double click on the folder here, you will see the pivot points in there. So we'll double click on it. We will go um, up to this point where we can actually see the pivot points. And now we will go back to our MT4 platform. So we click on the icon with our MT4 platform here. So first thing you want to do is click on the file menu. So we have file and click on open data folder. That will be the first step. And once you click on that open data folder, it will bring you to your terminal here. This is your um, MT4 installation. You will see an MQL4 folder in there. So this is your folder where we are going to install the indicator. So double click on that. And in there, you will see a folder called indicators. That's what we're looking for this one. So we'll double click on it to open it. And this is where we are going to paste our indicators. So we go back to the other one that we have open over here. So we hold our left mouse uh, click down our button down, or you can just click on it and just uh, press shift and highlight all the files here. Once the files are selected, we right click to copy the files. And then we go back to our other folder, the data folder that had opened up, which is this one where we have all our indicators. So it will have, it will say meta codes terminal, and it will have these uh, random numbers, then MQL for indicators. That's the path that we want to put this in. We'll click on paste and that will paste our pivot points. As we can see, we have our daily pivots and weekly pivots over there. So we'll go out of this one. So we'll close it out and go back to our meta trader here. So once you have uh, pasted it, which is right click and paste, now we are ready to install it. So at this point, we do need to close our MT4 down so that it can pick up the new folders. So we'll go back to our MT4 platform. Once our MT4 platform opens up, we are back at our charts view here. First, we'll open a new chart. Let's pick a chart. This is pound US dollar chart. Once we have the new chart, if there are any extra indicators that we don't need, we can remove that. In this case, we have a MACD. We can just right click on it, click on indicators list and delete the MACD because we don't really need it. So we just have a clean, fresh chart here. Next thing you want to do is go to insert indicators, move on to the right, go to custom, and then we see here the pivots daily. So we click on that and we'll have a new window that opens up. We say okay to that and we will see our pivot points are installed. So if you go to our daily chart there, we won't see the pivot points, but as you go to a four hour chart, we will see the pivot points here. Or if you go to one hour chart, we'll see the pivot points. 
The green line is our daily pivot. And then on top, we have R1, R2, R3. In the bottom, we have S1, S2, and S3. So those are our daily pivots. So if you take a look at your five minute chart or your 15 minute chart, you will be able to see the indicators. So they will appear on all charts up to four hour because they're daily pivots. And on the daily chart or higher time frame, they won't appear because they are only on, um, they will only appear on charts that are lower than the daily time frame. So that's how we install our daily pivots on our charts.